Hello, hello, welcome to my home. So today I'm doing my third video. You guys, I am so new to this. I have no idea what the hell I'm doing, but I'm just going with the flow, seeing what happens. So I wanted to do a extra special video. The video that I chose to do today was a how to shop at TJ Maxx. Now, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, Marshalls, they're all three the same thing. It all runs the same. So I thought I'd take you on my shopping spree. Um, if you are not a subscriber, please subscribe to me, guys. Like, this is all new to me, I know, but I have some really awesome video ideas that I want to do and I want to share with you guys. So please, please, please subscribe and watch my videos. I promise you, you will be amazed by some of the things that I have going on. So I look forward to that. A lot of people don't know how to really save money at TJ Maxx unless you know the secrets and luckily I ran into a great sales associate who sees me all the time and shared the secrets of how to shop at TJ Maxx. So I wanted to share with you something that I've been using for years and hopefully it helps you save money. So let's get started! Let's go shopping! <laughs> So I made it to the TJ Maxx. I am so excited about this. So let's go on a shopping spree. Pillows, comforters, these are great items to get here. I purchased um, some sheets here. They were via Spiga and I got so many compliments on them. So definitely check this um, section out. favorite sections to come to is the pet area guys I mean these prices. look at the selections that they have treats toys I mean just shampoo everything that you can think of I get all her toys here because they're so cheap I mean $3.99 $4.99 so when she tears them up I'm not so upset because I'm like okay I only paid $4.99 rather than Petco and PetSmart that charges so much money for the same products. I mean, why would you go anywhere else? And then they also have the little kitty stuff. Their bag section is amazing, guys. Look at all these different options. Even their Michael Kors options. All their Michael Kors that they have. I mean, this is amazing. It's just endless, the designer brand. Also have intimates and beauty intimates including bras and panties um, 90s nightgowns I mean it's not your Victoria's Secret but the prices are spectacular guys I mean look how cute these bras on these are amazing and then on Instagram you see all the people wearing these Calvin Klein panties I mean look at the price $9.99 for three pair. I mean, why would you pay and go to Nordstrom when you can come to TJ Maxx for $9.99? Check out all the brands that they have in here. Just all the brands that you can think of in here. They have everything from blender bottles to all different type of workout accessories including the yoga mats guys I mean these prices are just awesome the shoe section is also a great option when you come here I mean look at those shoes these are actually in style shoes guys and they're on sale for $24 I mean
Okay, at most TJ Maxx's, you will find these purple tags. If you do see a purple tag, those are mostly on the runway items, which are kind of um, name brand, top of the line items. Most of them are out of season, but this is a great way to get discounted fashion wear. As you can see, this one doesn't say past season, so it obviously is a new, probably in-season item that's just been discounted. Maybe something was wrong with it, or uh, they had too many in stock. It could be many reasons, but this is most likely going to be an in-season item, so. Okay, as you can see, this is a pair of Tory Burch off the runway. And if you look at the tag, it normally will tell you why it's discounted. So this one is Tory Burch and it's discounted because it's past season, so quite a humongous difference. Oh my god, look at these chokers, guys. Oh, this is my heaven. And look, their special occasion are chokers, so you can see they stay in style with everything that they oh my do. God, check out these headboards! I was actually gonna buy a really nice velvet headboard. That's one. This is another. I mean, check out these prices, guys. One twenty nine ninety nine for one. One forty nine ninety nine for the other. Oh my God! Oh my goodness! Like, this gives me life, y'all. I am a mirror girl, like I love mirrors. I think it makes your house look so fancy and bougie. So I think I'm gonna get these for sure. Oh my goodness, I think I'm going to get this set. It is so cute, guys. I think this is $14.99. This is $7.99. $16.99. And I believe this little baby is $14.99. That is so cute. I love shiny. Anything shiny is for me, guys. This screams my name. One of my favorite sections is the luggage department. I have purchased so many luggage options from here. Even accessories. They have, as you can see, a big variety. I have seen Tumi in here. I have seen Swiss gear, among others. I mean, look, a Samsonite for $79.99. You have sharper image for $59.99. I mean, the prices are spectacular. $89.99 compared to what you would get at a regular department store. I mean, look at this selection, guys. It's just endless. Okay, guys, the time everybody's been waiting for. How to save at TJ Maxx. Okay, hands down, Wednesdays are the best day to shop at TJ Maxx. Historically, um, Wednesdays are the days that they do the most markdowns. It's when they usually do their markdowns. So um, if you are there first thing Wednesday mornings, you are bound to get some great items, some red light specials as I may call it, some red clearance markdown tags, guys. Um, obviously, you know, they are open seven days a week. So if you're not there, able to be there on a Wednesday, at least try to be there first thing in the morning. That's when you're going to find some amazing things. Um, also, TJ Maxx does not do any sales but they do have annual yearly events where they pretty much try to get rid of everything out of season. So January and July are the best times to, to catch a lot of red markdowns and even yellow clearance items. So if you're looking to grab some things, January and July are the best times to do it. So definitely check those out. Wednesdays, mornings, January, July. If you can remember that, you are golden. Okay guys, I must stress enough. Please, please, please do not overlook the in-season bags that TJ Maxx has. I'm going to tell you why. This bag right here, it is a B. Mawalski bag. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. And this bag I actually saw at TJ Maxx um, some years ago. This is an old bag, but it's one of my, my two-go. This bag, it's a leather bag, like literally lambskin. I'm telling you, it feels like lambskin. Um, I got this bag i saw it in the tj maxx and it was white and it was a smaller one actually no i think it was the same size but it was in white and i went to tj maxx and i saw the bag and i was like i want that bag and so um i didn't purchase it and i left and but i wrote down all the details about the bag that it was a b mawalski and i wrote down just like you know the generic things like it had the big coops and stuff like that and i ended up Finding the purse at Macy's, y'all. Macy's. Now, the purse in TJ Maxx was a 
I think it was two hundred dollars, so it was one ninety nine ninety nine, and the exact same purse, in like I think it came in like three different colors, was five no about four hundred dollars. So I ended up having to pay four hundred dollars for the bag because when I went back to TJ Maxx, it was gone. So guys, do not do not ever think if you see that Michael Kors bag, Michael Kors bag, that that bag isn't real or it's an out of season. It's not people. The only thing is I've learned that. TJ Maxx, unlike Macy's, Macy's um, goes to Michael Kors and they say, I'll buy a thousand bags from you and um, whatever I don't sell, I will send back. Whereas TJ Maxx will say, we'll buy 500 bags for half the cost that, you, that Macy's or Nordstrom's is paying for and we will not give you the bags back. And so they get the bags for a fraction of the price and you pay a fraction of the price while people at Macy's like myself are getting scammed people. Do not, for, don't, don't get caught up in the scams. Shop smart, I promise you it works. Shop smart. I have gotten so much furniture from TJ Maxx. You will find some incredible steals, believe it or not. In fact, this little item that I have right here, I got from TJ Maxx and it had a little scratch on it. And because it had a little scratch on it, I got 10% off of it. So when you see items like this, grab them. If you see any imperfections, you let them know. And you, that's another great way to save money. Okay, the top way to save money at TJ Maxx are markdowns. A lot of people don't realize that a lot of items are supposed to be marked down and they are not. I mean, let's think about this. You walk into a TJ Maxx and it's just random stuff everywhere, sorted by size or likeness. You know, you have your people, your sales associate on the floor and they're you know, changing out tickets, putting new markdowns, and they're distracted. Hey girl, how was your weekend? And oh, it's five o'clock, I gotta go home. And there's that one item that has been missed, that wasn't marked down or wasn't put on the clearance. I mean, it happens, everyone's human. But to miss out on that markdown is something you do not want to happen. So how do you make sure you get the discounts you're entitled to? Well, the first thing you need to do is make sure you talk to a sales associate. Either scan the floor, and if you can't find a sales associate on the floor, go to the register, and before you check out, have them check each item individually using the price checking machine. Do not let them use the register. They have to use that machine. Okay, TJ Maxx is not like large department stores like Macy's and Nordstrom's where you purchase an item for $50 and they scan that ticket and all of a sudden you realize you saved $20. It's not like that. TJ Maxx system is based on original prices only. Whatever is on that white tag is what's going to be in the system. Anything that has a red tag or a yellow tag will not be in the system. If you ever look at the tag, you will see that there is a barcode always on there. If it's a white tag, there's a barcode. If it's a red tag, there's a barcode. If it's a yellow tag, there's a barcode. That barcode is the only way that the register can register that purchase. With that being said, you want to make sure, again, that every item is checked for markdown. If an item says it's $59.99, and, it, and it's, let's just say, supposed to be marked down for $29.99. If it does not have that sticker for $29.99, you're not going to get that price. So I encourage you to take time and, again, have them check every item to make sure there are no markdowns. Okay guys, if you're one of those people who do not want to go to the front or ask for a markdown, which I don't know why, another way that you can find out is if you are if you are owed a markdown is by looking at the barcode. If you see in the barcode, the number that's in the square represents the month the item came to TJ Maxx. So as you can see in both of these, the number is 10, which represents October. Now TJ Maxx runs on a 24 site, I'm sorry, 24 month cycle. So that means one through 10 would be the prior year, 11 through 24 would mean the current year. So right now you can see it is October of 2015. 11 through 24 would be 2016. So if you see two items that have the same month, which is 10, the same price, then the markdown should be the same price as well. 
So for instance, if they both have 10, they both have 19.99, and one has 16.99 and one has 23, then you know you're owed money because they should be the same number. So that's another easy way to find out if you are doing a markdown. enjoy watching this video as much as I had fun making it yes I got a few gifts of my own but um, again any way you can save money why not I'm in the process of buying a house so five dollars that I save can be five dollars in my house fund so if you can save why not um, again if you are not a subscriber subscribe today if you like this video have any questions or comments put it in the comment section below and if you like this video give it a thumbs up Yes, guys. Anyways, happy shopping, XOXO. Bye, guys. Oh, my God. Y'all, look at this rug. I love it. The fall fur. Oh, kiss me life.